Hello and welcome to the how to video series of WP Ultimate CSV Importer. In this video, we will show you how to import WooCommerce simple product information into your WordPress. Let's start off with the CSV preparation. So here's my CSV file. I have three products in it. Add your own product SKU and then in the post title, content and description section, you can add your own text. And this is the post status. If you have the post status as private or password protected, you have to mention the password within calibrasis. And here's the visibility section. So to choose the first option, you have to mention the value as 1. And for shop only, you have to mention the value as 2. And for search results, mention the option as 3. And for hidden, mention the option as 4 in your CSV file. And then the product type. So here I'm going to import simple products. So I have mentioned the value as 1. For grouped, the value should be 2. And for external product, the value should be 3. And for variable, you have to mention the value as 4. And then coming to the next section, you can mention your own regular price and then sales price. And in the stock status, you can mention the status, whether it is in stock, out of stock or on back order. You have to mention the exact value here. So manage stock, it is a checkbox value. So to enable the checkbox, you have to give the value as yes. To disable it, you can give it as no. So if you have enabled, you need to give the stock quantity. In allow back order section, if you need to choose the value do not allow, you need to mention the value as no in your CSV file. And to choose the second option, you have to mention the value as notify in your CSV file. And to choose the third option, you have to mention S in your CSV file. So this is the section back orders. And you can mention the threshold values. And sold individually is the checkbox value. So to enable the checkbox, give the value as yes, else no. Coming to the next values. You can mention the weight, length, width and then height. So upsell and cross sell. You have to mention your product ID value here. So to choose multiple products, you can mention the product IDs in comma separated values. And coming to the next one, product attribute name. To add multiple attribute names, you have to mention the values using pipeline separator. I have three values, name, color and then capacity. To add the attribute values, here's the delimiters. You need to use pipeline and then comma separation. Let's take the attribute name color. I have three different attribute values for color like brown, black and silver. So all these three values are need to be separated using pipeline separator and to separate the color attribute value with the capacity attribute value you have to use the comma separator and then coming to the next one product attribute visibility. So to enable the checkbox you have to mention the value as 1 to disable it you can mention it as 0 and I have added the product note categories and tag to add multiple tags you can use the comma separator. And then featured image, you can either use your media gallery URL as well as external URLs. And the gallery images, you can add multiple images here. The values will need to be separated using a pipeline separator. So that's all about the CSV preparation. Let's import the values. First upload your CSV file. Choose WooCommerce products in the import each record as drop down. Now click on continue. So if your CSV header is same as that of the WP fields, then import will automatically map the fields. You can also map the desired field from this drop down. Navigate to the product meta field section and all the fields are mapped accurately. So once done with your mapping, click on continue. If you have added any images in your CSV, enable this and then click on continue. Now finally import. So that's it. The import is complete. Let's check the values. So here is the three products I have imported. 
By this way, you can easily import any number of WooCommerce product information into your WordPress with WP Ultimate CSV Importer. Thank you for watching.